We've been filming non-stop for weeks, and at this point, I honestly kind of just want to go home. But <laughs> instead, I'm here announcing that it's time for Shovelware's Brain Game! He's just a silly little guy. It's the Dancing Banana! Probably geography. <laughs> A one can supply of delicious banana cream soda from Shovelware Foods. Only for the finest of cola connoisseurs, this can is shaken, not stirred. Napkins to clean up spillage not included. I want to go to Canada to visit Niagara Falls, eat some delicious brand pancakes with authentic maple syrup, and even visit the childhood home of Bordy the Smart Board in Alberta. But um, I can't find it on my globe, somehow. Oh, Canada, which continent can you be found on? Knowing that should help me narrow it down a bit, eh? Ooh, that's no good. <laughs> Taste test. <laughs> My friends in Europe have been begging me to try bratwurst. Bratwurst this, bratwurst that. I'm supposed to try it and report back to them by tonight. But I have no idea what a bratwurst even is. Help me out. <laughs> Not a chance. I don't like that. <laughs> The dancing banana makes me uncomfortable, but I, I can't quite pinpoint what it is about him. It's not his shape, and it's not his smell, though that is offensive in its own right. Oh, I know what it is. It's his color. That particular shade of yellow is just weird. What phobia must I have? Taste test. The process of making cheese is long and convoluted and has many, 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 many steps. Which of the following is used in the process of making cheese? Talking about states.
Let's bring out a special guest to ask the next question. It's Forty the Smart Board. Let's see what the question is this time. Look at this diagram of the water cycle. In which form is water considered a gas? Another question down. See you all later. Monumental landmarks. I'm uh, trying to pawn off a large chunk of limestone. What missing piece of the Great Sphinx of Giza's face should I claim it to be if I want to sell it to a museum? Flags of the world. <laughs> oh, oh, oh no, I fell asleep on a train somewhere in Europe. I must be in an entirely different country than I was when I boarded. Wait, I see a flag outside. It's got three vertical stripes. A black stripe on the left, then a yellow stripe in the middle, and then a red stripe on the right. Help, what country am I in? Taste test. Cow tools. What? You don't know what cow tools are? Well, it's, uh, well, I took an anthropology course in college and learned that humans used to be defined as the only animal that made and shaped tools. And that made me think, hey, what if cows made tools? And I just kind of, I tried making what I thought cows would make, and um, one of them is a hand saw or, or, or something, even though they don't have hands, they have cloven hooves. I, I don't know. Look, I just thought it would be interesting, okay? Shut up. Mm-mm-mm. I love cake, and I love cookies. They share a lot of ingredients, but there's one particular ingredient that's considered the main ingredient in both. What is it? That's pretty based!
What's the word? <laughs> What is the most common word used in the English language? Oh, hey, I just used it in that sentence. Probably geography. I love paper boats. You know, I used to love sending them sailing down the creek by my house, but lately I've been wanting more. More challenge, more adventure, more water. If I wanted to send a paper boat sailing down the longest river in the world, which river would I need to put it in? Bogey. I don't like that. I swear, getting my paycheck every week is a nightmare. Well, it's not hard to get per se, even if it's not enough to live on. Hint, hint. But it's like I'm outright afraid of money or something. I get seriously spooked whenever I see the number next to the little dollar sign. What would you call being afraid of wealth? Sports mix. Did you hear? Ricky Henderson has stolen over 1,400 bases over his career. I'll bet he's holding them all for ransom or something. <laughs> In baseball, which base is stolen the most often? New from Lazy, it's the do-it-yourself obby kit. With over one variety of rectangular obstacles that may or may not be supposed to be lava, anyone can build their own obby without having to think about actual level design or matching obstacles to the theme for even one fraction of a second. Speaking of which, you should play my obby sometime. I worked really hard on it, you know. Congratulations! You're the winner of Shovelware's Brain Game! We'll see you all next time for another brain-tingling episode of Shovelware's Brain Game! This episode of Shovelware's Brain Game is brought to you by Marsh's Grocery Store, Swabby Foods, Swabby Prices,